In this video, I'll show you how to move parts of someone's body or face around with the new Paintex plugin from Cormelt. This model has a subtle smile, but we can make it more pronounced if needed. And here I'll exaggerate the effect to make it obvious. Start by finding the C2 Paintex category of effects, then drag the Tracked Paint effect to a clip in the timeline. Then click this Open Editor button in the inspector to open the full screen interface. I'm at the beginning of the clip already, but you can use the playhead at the bottom of the interface if you need to be somewhere else. To begin, I'll choose the Warp tool from the panel at the top and increase the size of the brush with the square bracket keys to about 50 pixels. The Warp tool lets you push part of an image around, and like the Forward Warp tool in the Liquify feature in Photoshop, this tool is best used with repeated small strokes. I'll push the edge of the mouth and the cheek up and out, as if she's smiling a little more. Now I'll track forward by pressing this button here and check that the effect looks OK all the way through. Now that I'm at the end of the clip, I need to do the same to the other side. Because it's going to be tracked separately, I'll make a new layer by pressing the plus button here. Now I'll use the warp tool again to move up the other side of her face. When I'm done, I'll track backwards. After tracking, I can add more warp brush strokes if I want to, turn strokes on or off, or move strokes around using the selection tool. I don't need to retrack. Now I'll press Save Changes, and I'm done. Keep watching the next videos for more tips. Paintex is available now from Cormelt.com, and there's a free trial too. Thanks for watching.